But it's time for our weekly segment, Informed Decisions with Lauren Dempsey, where we explore the Colorado housing market. And if you're thinking of buying a home, listen up to this. Yeah, that's right. So today we're actually diving into how to prevent regrets during your home buying journey and experience. We want to welcome back Lauren. How are you, my friend? Good, good. Good. So first and foremost, what's one big challenge for buyers in today's market right now? Yep. I think the biggest surprise for a lot of buyers is how fast things happen. So a lot of my clients, when we're out looking at homes, we only go out maybe one, two times and they find a home. So that can kind of take them by surprise because they think they need to see more homes. Right. When in reality, mm -hmm. they've been doing tons of research before. They've been on Zillow, they've been on Realtor.com, Homes.com, looking at apps for months on end. So they already have seen the inside of lots of homes. The other thing is the surprise of how quickly we might have to write an offer. Mm -hmm. So a lot of times there is multiple offers on homes right now because we're in our busy season. Mm -hmm. So if we go see a home, you might have to write an offer very quickly after that if you really want to buy that home. So it can be a little bit jarring and that's why I really stress the importance of having a home buyer consultation that's about an hour with my team and I along with a financial conversation that's also another hour to make sure you understand the full picture and you are prepared to move fast because that's what our market demands. Right, it eases the nerves so you can make that quick decision yeah. right mm -hmm. off the bat. Exactly. Yeah. So in your opinion based on what you've seen, what are some of the things a buyer should be doing now to be prepared for this? Yep. So there are three things that I think a buyer can be doing now if it, they're not yet in their window. The first is one, call me and let's have a strategy call. It's about 15 minutes. We'll talk about your timeline, your financials, get you hooked up with a lender to get that going and to really understand the process and answer any questions that you may have. The second thing they can be doing is just looking around the space that they live in and create three lists. Things that they like about that space, things that they don't like and things that they must have in their new home that they buy. I would say keep that list on your counter because you're going to think of things over days and weeks and mm -hmm. you're going to want to continue to add to it. So just thinking about your space is really critical. And the most challenging piece is identifying location because some buyers can't buy in the location that they currently rent. Right. So going off exploring different neighborhoods is critical. If you see a house you like online, go drive by it. That will help eliminate or include it in your search because location, again, is just very challenging for a lot of buyers to nail down. Yeah, absolutely. And when you dive into this journey initially, and you hire on that agent, what should we expect from that agent at the end of the day? Or what should we expect from your <laughs> agents? Because you guys are a well-oiled machine. Yes, yes. I always uh, view our role as strategic advisors, right? We're helping guide you through the process and providing insights for you to make an informed decision. So a lot of that means I'm going to tell you what you need to hear and mm -hmm. want not what you want to hear. Right. And I think that that is crucial because this is an emotional experience. Um, when we're looking at homes, a lot of my clients, they should be focusing on the flow of the home? Does it meet their needs? How's that checklist? Does it balance there? Well, I'm looking under the hood. What's the electrical system look like? What does the water heater and the furnace look like? Are there signs of structural issues? Is it a north facing driveway? Is the location of the home strange could, that could impact future resale? So you're focusing on the flow and the lifestyle while we're looking underneath the hood to make sure that it's a smart move to write an offer. Yeah. A north wow. facing driveway. <laughs> yeah, you, very common. Yeah. I don't have one of those. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Man, you still have snow in your driveway. So what's one of the biggest mistakes you see buyers mm -hmm. make? Yeah, but it actually happens when I'm on the listing side. So when I'm representing sellers and the buyer's done their inspection, they submit their list of inspection requests of the seller. And I often don't see any due diligence done by those buyers. They haven't gotten any quotes. They mm -hmm. don't understand the scope of the work. And they're really depending on the seller to do that due diligence for them, which is a huge mistake in my opinion, because the seller is going to go based off of what's cost and what's most affordable and gets us past inspection, where a buyer is really going to want to advocate for doing the work correctly. And they, sometimes the inspector doesn't have all the insight, and that can mean bringing in specialists to review. So buyers really need to do their due diligence because they own the problems once they become the right. homeowner. They absolutely do. Lauren, thanks for coming in studio. Always week great after material. week. Every yeah. Wednesday, Wednesday, you guys. Yes. Lauren is in studio with us Thank you. with a bunch of tips and tricks. Thanks a lot. We appreciate yeah. it. Thanks, Lauren. Here's yeah. a little more info. You can scan this QR code to learn more and visit uh, Lauren Dempsey.com slash buyer's guide to get uh, her free 20 uh, copy of her free 20 page uh, home buyer's guide. That's really an insightful thing to have to successfully navigate a rapidly changing market. You can call Lauren and her team today at the Dempsey Group and be sure to tune in next week for another episode on Wednesday of Informed Decisions. Thank you to the Dempsey Group for sponsoring this segment.